What's up, muscle and strength? I have BB Pro Joel Thomas here. Today I'm gonna to take you guys through three of my favorite mass building exercises for biceps. So the first bicep uh, exercise today, we're gonna to do spider curls. I really like anything that's chest supported, whether it's a back exercise, bicep exercise, whatever. Uh, it just takes your uh, ability to swing and kind of rock and take the momentum uh, out of whatever exercise you're doing. Uh, that would cheat uh, tension off of the muscle that you're trying to work. I'm gonna start my arms uh, fully extended and they're just at a hang. So I'm not bringing them forward or backwards. Um, and wherever my elbows are at the start of the exercise, I wanna leave them there. So I don't want it to be a drag curl. So um, my elbows are gonna freeze here and then I'm gonna curl out front, squeeze the top just for a half a second and then slow on the way down. Full stretch at the bottom and back here. So triceps, we're gonna lock out at the bottom. Uh, elbows aren't gonna go anywhere and I'm just gonna squeeze up and a control negative. Basically this just keeps you from cheating. It doesn't allow you to lean back and rock into the exercise. Uh, it's where you really just have to pull with the biceps. Uh, and another thing is, I see a lot of people um, rushing the negatives on bicep stuff especially. Um, and you really want to get a nice control negative. Um, that's really where you're going to get some soreness. That's really going to help the muscle building just slowing down the negative on bicep stuff. So for this exercise, I'm usually going to start with at least three to four warm-up sets, whether it's just dumbbell curls or just lighter weight here. Um, I just really like to warm up those muscles and get some blood flow to that connective tissue just to prevent injury. After my warm-up sets, uh, I'm gonna do about three to four real working sets, maybe leaving one rep in reserve. Uh, I'm not gonna go all the way to failure um, and that's gonna allow me to keep my form a little tighter. So the second bicep exercise uh, is going to be a preacher curl. I'm going to add a little bit of a variation to it. I'm going to do full extension, full contraction for the first eight reps. For the second eight reps, I'm going to sit way, way over the top and just focus on uh, the top part of the contraction. So basically what I'll be doing is an isolated just contraction at the top. So I'm just going to be working that, that top uh, half or quarter of the rep uh, to where I'm really making my biceps uh, contract hard, uh, almost to where they're going to cramp. So I like to grab uh, a little bit wide, leave my elbows exactly where they are. Make sure for these, uh, that your elbows keep contact with the pad uh, throughout the movement. What you don't want is to sit back off of this pad and let your elbows rock up. You're basically cheating tension off the bicep. So elbows dug into the pad, full reps. And once I get to eight, then I'm gonna sit way over the top this way and just work this top little range. So. So for these, I'm gonna do four sets of eight and eight. So eight full, eight top partials. All right, so I'm gonna finish the bicep workout just with hammer curls. There are a couple different variations. Some people like to do them right in front. I like to do them across basically reach into the far pec. I feel like I get a little more forearm work out of that too. So here goes. So I'm kind of just leaving my elbows where they are and pulling across. So for sets and reps here, I'm gonna do two working sets uh, to where I'm almost a failure. Um, if it's a week before a deload week, I'll go all the way to failure. Um, and then on my third set, I'm gonna turn that into a drop set. So I may start at 50 pounds, then I'm gonna drop to 35, 20, 15, and finish off with 10s. So I'm really wiping it out just on the last set of these. So 
So those are three of my favorite mass building exercises for biceps. Go give them a try. Thanks for watching and go subscribe below.